Good day and welcome to our celebration for Wednesday for, at the Church of St. John the Divine. Colin and I would like to acknowledge that as we lead prayer today, we are meeting on the lands of the Algonquin people, from the Songhees and the Esquimalt peoples. Today, our prayers are going to be taken from the book of Celtic Spirituality. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. One thing I have asked of the Lord, this is what I seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord and to seek him in his temple. Who is it that you seek? We seek the Lord our God. Do you seek him with all your heart? Amen. Lord have mercy. Do you seek him with all your soul? Amen. Lord have mercy. Do you seek him with all your mind? Amen. Christ have mercy. Do you seek him with all your strength? Amen. Christ have mercy. To whom shall we go? You have the words of eternal life, and we have believed and have come to know that you are the Holy One of God. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. As we reflect on the Word of God, we have a passage from Psalm 147, verse 2 and 3. The Lord builds up Jerusalem. He gathers the outcasts of Israel. He heals the brokenhearted and binds up their wounds. Isaiah 10, verses 1 to 3. Ah, you who make iniquitous decrees, who write oppressive statutes to turn aside the needy from justice and to rob the poor of my people of their right, that widows may be your spoil and that you may make the orphans your prey. What will you do on the day of punishment in the calamity that will come from far away? To whom will you flee for help, and where will you leave your wealth? And a reading from James. Religion that is pure and undefiled before God the Father is this to care for orphans and widows in their distress, to keep oneself unstained by the world. Today's meditation is from John Donovan. You need to be generous to yourself in order to receive the love that's around you. You can suffer from a desperate hunger to be loved. You can search long years in lonely places far outside of yourself. Yet the whole time, this love is but a few inches away from you. It is at the edge of your soul that you have been blind to its presence. We must be attentive in order to be able to receive. And from Boris Pasternak, when a great moment knocks on the door of your life, it is often no louder than the beating of your heart, and it is very easy to miss it. Let us now take a few minutes of silence and quietness.
Christ is a light. Illumine and guide me. Christ is a shield overshadow me. Christ under me. Christ over me. Christ beside me. On my left and my right. This day be within and without me. Lowly and meek, yet all powerful. Be in the heart of each to whom I speak. In the mouth of each who speaks unto me. This day be within and without me. Lowly and meek, yet all powerful. Christ is a light. Christ is a shield, Christ beside me, on my left and my right. And may the peace of the Lord Christ go with you, wherever he may send you. May he guide you through the wilderness, protect you through the storm. May he bring you home rejoicing at the wonders he has shown you. And he, may he bring you home rejoicing once again into our doors. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Have a wonderful day. Let us pray for one another.